It's time to go over the juicy part. What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another video. Before we start this off, make sure you subscribe to the channel, turn your post notifications on, and smash that like button. We got a lot of content coming out. You definitely want to stay tuned to that. We got another fire unboxing today. These sneakers I was super excited to get. I got them from Nike. So... Nike always comes through with a super quick shipping. Got these in just a couple days after the release, so I'm super excited. These are the Hyper Crimson Ones. Jordan Ones are an all-time favorite sneaker, and Hyper Crimson is a dope name, so I'm ex super excited to see how these look. Alright, so check it out. We got the Nike receipt. Just toss that aside. And of course, you already know, we got the Nike black and red simple box. Pretty much just a standard Jordan 1 box. So let's put the knife aside and unbox these babies. So, yo, check these out. The fire on these. It's got the creamish white Air Jordan wing on the side as well as the nice gray swoosh with suede. And it's pretty dope how they are adding this little detail to all the Jordan 1s that I have seen so far that are supposed to release in 2019. It does say SP19 Air Jordan 1 High OG. So that's really dope. And it's just like... A really interesting colorway it's got like the nice salmon pink up here as well as the orange on the heel on the tongue it has a yellow lettering and the orange swoosh on it so the details on this is mad crazy the leather feels pretty nice I would say Jordan brand has been killing it when it comes to the leather quality for the Jordan ones so it does have the white midsole and then it continues with the light gray sole. This is honestly just an incredible sneaker. I am super happy I managed to cop. So on the inside of the sneaker it has a nice orange insole with the white Nike Air lettering. Just realized that they also have the extra orange lace so whatever you want to rock it with. You can do the orange or the black. I'm sure either way would look pretty fire. So now that we've gone over the sneaker a little bit, it is time to go over the juicy parts. We gotta get these bad boys on feet. So let's check them out. So that is going to be a wrap on the video. Let me know what you guys think of this sneaker. I personally really love it. Super glad I could add it to the collection. And honestly, 
I would highly suggest or recommend getting this sneaker. The resale prices vary on the size. The smaller sizes do go for a hefty price in maybe up to the 300 range if it's like a size 7. But if you have like a bigger feet, maybe around like 10 and a half, 11, these are going for like pretty much just right above retail after tax. So I suggest getting these while you can because you never know in the future these might raise up in prices because this is a pretty fire sneaker. So make sure you subscribe to the channel, turn your post notifications notifications on and smash that like button you guys stay tuned to what we got coming up we got a lot of fire and until next time we'll see you in the next one